to welcome you all here to the beautiful surroundings of Colshaw Hall on this very special occasion, the day of their marriage. But we all know that marriage is more than just the wedding day. It's about your lives together once the celebrations are over. Marriage is a journey, an adventure, where each of you will love, care for, and support each other, and form a circle of love that gathers in your whole family. Sophia, today I promise to spend the rest of my life with you. To spend the rest of my life with you. I will be faithful and honest. I will be faithful and honest. I will share with you my hopes and dreams. I will share with you my hopes and dreams. I will always be there when you need me most. I will always be there when you need me most. And will respect and support you. I will respect and support you. As we go through life together. As we go through life together. Ben, today I promise. Ben, today I promise. To spend the rest of my life with you. To spend the rest of my life with you. I will be faithful and honest. I will be faithful and honest. I will share with you my hopes and dreams. I will share with you my hopes and dreams. I will always be there when you need me most. I will always be there when you need me most. And will respect and support you and we'll respect and support you as we go through life together as we go through life together Sophia, all that I have, I give to you Sophia, all that I have, I give to you all that I am, I share with you all that I am, I share with you I give you this ring I give you this ring as a symbol of my love as a sing symbol of my love for today, for tomorrow for today, for tomorrow. And for all the years to come. And for all the years to come. Please wear it as a sign of my love. Please wear it as a sign of my love. And as a notice to the world. And as a notice to the world. That you have chosen me. That you have chosen me. To be your husband. To be your husband. Ben, all that I have, I give to you. All that I am, I share with you. All that I am, I share with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. For today, for tomorrow. For today, for tomorrow. And for all the years to come. And for all of the years to come. 
Please wear it as a sign of my love. Please wear it as a sign of my love. And as a notice to the world. And as a notice to the world. That you have chosen me. That you have chosen me. To be your wife. To be your wife. It therefore gives me the very, very greatest of pleasure to say, you are now husband and wife. Ben, you know what to do. <laughs> Thank you all for coming today. Uh, I know a lot of you have taken some time off work to be here, so we really appreciate you all for taking the time off to come and celebrate this special day with us. For those of you that don't know, we always originally planned to get married in Mexico, but um, when we sat down and started planning the wedding, we soon realised we wanted to get married in England and spend the day with as many of you guys as possible. So again, thank you all for coming. We really do appreciate each and every one of you being here today. It's nice to be here and all you lot to witness my daughter getting married. I think it's beautiful anyway. Um, Ben's a lovely lad. He's a real nice lad. Um, he's come to our house a couple of times and he's been nice, hasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody wishes them a happy life together, uh, and that's about it, really. Thanks, Dad. Yeah, she's a beautiful girl, isn't she? Yes. <laughs> and it's a lovely life. So today is an extra special day for me and Sophia. It's also our 10 year anniversary. Uh, it's been 10 amazing years and I'm so lucky to now be married to Sophia. Um, she looks absolutely amazing today, just like she did on the day we first met over 10 years ago. So we actually met in a club called Pure. Um, I was flashing my PFA card around <laughs> And then um, we danced to Get It Shorty in the R&B room. And Sphere had bagged herself a footballer and thought she was set for life. <laughs> um, and then a few months later, I was in my wellies cutting grass for a living. So uh, it was a <laughs> But luckily, I had um, bought myself enough time to um, win her over.
then, about seven years ago now, on a PT course. We got on straight away, and I told him, you know what, I want to run my own gym one day. And he said, me too. <laughs> that made me think, wait a minute, I didn't want to do this all by myself. and I could easily boss that little midget around. <laughs> he was perfect. As a lot of you know, Sophia likes to get her own way at times, and I like to do everything I can to keep her happy. And now that we're married, I can promise that nothing will ever change, and I will continue to treat her like a little princess for the rest of our lives. I do actually believe that Ben and Sophia are made for each other. You know what, I've had to actually face sometimes the reason I don't see Ben as much as I want to is because he genuinely does love spending time with you. You are both truly amazing people. You're incredibly loyal, caring. My kids, obviously, Lizzie and James, absolutely love you. And you have become mine and George's best friends. And as I mentioned earlier, I know that one day you'll both become two absolutely brilliant parents to some very small children. <laughs>